Hi, everybody, and welcome to our Equilibrium Lab, where we're going to get a chance to see Le Chatelier's principle in action. So first thing you need to do is you just need to read over, and this will give you a nice little review of Le Chatelier's principle. Then I've got some um, pre-lab questions for you, and you should definitely fill those out. All right. Then we're going to be looking at the reaction for this lab. When... Um, the video continues, you're gonna see a really, really dark purple solution. And it is this reaction that is at equilibrium that we see right here. You're then gonna see Maurice add, all right, some calcium chloride, which is gonna increase the concentration of Cl minus. And you wanna see what happens to that reaction. You'll then see Maurice add some water, all right? And with that, it's gonna increase the amount of water and let's see how the reaction responds for that. All right. Um, as you go through and you'll watch the video, you'll hear a little part I tried to fix it. I misspoke and I said that water was a reactant. As we can see in this reaction, water is on the product side. So I just wanted to clarify that. So Maurice will go through these procedures. You're then going to answer the analysis questions. All right. Uh, why did you get different color changes? And then um, some questions about energy and if you were to add some other um, components as well. All right, so enjoy the lab and have a great day. Hi, welcome to our lab. Here is our reaction at equilibrium. It's a deep purple color. Right, Maurice is just gonna put some of our equilibrium reaction into two test tubes so you can see the color. Again, it looks, it's, it is a very, very deep, deep purple, deep bluish almost. Okay. We're going to leave one of them there. It's okay that they're not the exact same amounts. We're going to leave one of them there just to show you um, as a control. All right. So again, this is what the system looks like when we have dissolved our cobalt two chloride into our alcohol. All right. And now we are going to mess with the system at equilibrium. So the first thing that's going to happen is Maurice is going to add all right, some calcium chloride. He's crushing that up first because we want it to be in a nice fine powder. Put this down. Yeah, this so it's going to turn more into a powder. that's crushed up and he's going to put a little spoonful of that into one of our test tubes. By adding calcium chloride, what we're doing is we're adding chloride ions. So that is our stress. We are adding the chloride ion. So again, we're going to take a look at our two. Maurice is putting the calcium chloride into the reaction on the left a little bit more. And now go ahead and take the stirring rod and stir that up. We're gonna look for any color change. You can wanna hold the test tube while you do that. Okay, you can already see at the bottom that purple is turning blue. Okay. Keep going, keep going. All right, we might wanna add a little bit more to it. Adding more to make this go a little bit faster. There we go. All right, now give that a good stir. Okay, we're just going to stir this and we will come right back. Okay, Maurice has been stirring now for a couple minutes. Now put the two next to each other so we can compare color. All right, so you can definitely see now that. We'll kind of hold this up maybe to the light. I eh, know it's better down here. All right, that our test tube that we added the calcium chloride to is definitely a brighter blue color and it's not quite as purple. All right, you want to remove the stirring rod, Maurice? 
Okay, the next stress we're going to do is we are going to add water to the system. So notice on your lab, water, water is, is a, a reactant, product. okay, in this system. So we are going to add water and let's see what happens. Here. Mm -hmm. Keep going, keep going. All right, so you can definitely see we have now changed that system. It has shifted over. Sorry. You can. It has shifted over. All right, and now we are clearly on the pink side. All right, so that's a much easier color change to see. So we saw it go from that equilibrium system, kind of deep, deep purple color, to shift it over to blue, and now we have shifted over to pink. All right.